Hi buddies, you guys are watching Quake Unicorn. So in my last Minecraft survival video, I was hopelessly lost in the frozen tundra, trying desperately to find some friends for my cows. I had literally no idea how to get home, so I mined some iron, I built a compass, we are now heading back to my base. Also, I now have a dog. His name's Noodle. So the good news is this wasn't a completely wasted journey because now I have Noodle, who I hope will get along with my cows really well. What on earth is going on here? Oh, whoa. Okay, so there's a giant pool of lava and it's setting everything on fire. Cool, let's go a different way. I've been away from my base for about a week and I've been sleeping in these like little dirt holes that I've been like digging for myself every night. So I'm so excited to get home. I want Noodle to meet the cows. I want him to meet the whole flock, all of my sheep. Everyone is gonna be so excited. But we're not home yet. So I'm gonna be spending tonight in this beautiful dirt accommodation. This is one of the nicest holes I've stayed in in a while actually. Noodle baby, would you like a breakfast bone? Okay, I don't think he wants any bones. How about a steak? He's full. Noodle's like, come on, press on with the journey. I want to meet these cows. I've heard so much about them. Can we please get a move on? I'm still not used to having him follow me. I like keep looking back to see if he's still there. Noodle and I have been traveling for days now. Just following where that compass points, trying to make our way home. All right, let's check the maps and see how we're doing. Not on that one. Oh my gosh, the, the dot, the dot has appeared. I know I'm not technically on the map, but I'm just off of the map. I am so close to the map. I am so close to home. I haven't been this close in so long. Oh, there's Noodle trying to swim after me. He's quite slow. Come on, buddy. Does anybody know if dogs can actually go in boats? If anyone has any tips for transporting your dog when you don't have a lead, let me know in the comment section. So I'm kind of half looking at the map, half looking at the compass, see if it points my way home. And, oh, what just happened? Just turn around. Is this? I think this is where I spawned. Does that mean that my house is really close by? It has to be close by. Look, there's trees that I must have cut down. That's a clue. Is that my house? I think, I think, it, I think that's the mountain by my house. <gasps> Yes, I can see it. Home, sweet home. Come, Noodle, this is your castle. Everything that you can see belongs to you. I have never been so excited to get home in my entire life. Look at the salmon spawning in my river. Where are my friendly squid? Any squid around? All oh, my crops. Okay, the sugar cane has done excellently in my absence. Oh, the wheat is looking good. I can't believe that it's not entirely mature. And my cows, how happy are you to see me? Guess what? I brought you a pal. You are gonna love him. Everyone, meet Noodle. Noodle, meet everyone. These are my cows. See, they don't get to do a lot of roaming unlike you, so you guys are gonna have lots of stories to tell each other. Noodle, would you like to meet the sheep? You know what, it's fine. We're all gonna have a chance to get to know each other later. I am gonna go and sleep in my own bed, in my own little house, which is actually looking quite small now that I've been on a bit of a journey. Noodle, come in. Come inside, boy. Nope, Already, You can sleep out there if you like. He likes to roam, so. And my bed, my beautiful pink bed, which I can't sleep in yet because it's not nighttime. That's cool. I'll just uh, hang out the window here. Watch the moon eat a bit of evening steak. Oh, he heard that. Noodle, here you will have all the steak you could ever hope for. Oh, he loves it. No need to sit. Good boy. Good morning, Noodle. Did you sleep well? I think that Noodle actually really loves it here. And I think that he's trying to tell me that we should probably get going on some of the chores that have been neglected in our absence. First of all, feeding the cows. Good morning, ladies. Apologies for my protracted absence. Oh, look at all those hearts. They are so happy to have me home. And also I feel like they're getting along with Noodle extremely well. Actually, I can't even see him. Oh, oh there he is. Oh, yes, of course I missed you too. All right, so now that we're kind of caught up on the chores, Noodle, come this way, buddy. Are you just really just gonna stand there in the gate? Come on, come on. Oh my gosh, Noodle. Anyway, so now that we're back home, I really feel like this teeny tiny little house is not gonna be big enough for both me and Noodle. So I wanna build something a little bit bigger and a little bit more permanent. Hey Noodle, what do you think? Show me love hearts if you think we need a bigger house. Oh, yep, nope, Noodle agrees. I don't know if this is crazy, but I feel like it would also be a really nice idea if there were room for cows in the house, like kind of like a upstairs, downstairs, like animal, human cohabitation space. Just one room for us to all be together, you know? And there's not as much room as I want on this little bit of land here. So I think, I think I'm gonna move up to this area, move up to greener pastures. Now, if you've been watching this series, you'll know that I had a couple of problems with some skeleton jockeys in this neighborhood, but there's no denying there's a pretty nice view of the farm from up here. We got a nice view of the river. Sure, there might be some skeleton horses still lurking around, but you know what? I feel like they might be my friends too one day. I feel like they might be my friends too. 
Before we get started on the new house, Noodle and I decided to spend the day down in the mines so that we could try to discover any valuables, and it was pretty fun having a little buddy with me while I was doing my mining. Come on, bud. But now I'm tired, ready to go to bed and begin the construction tomorrow. I do need to figure out what kind of design I want. Is there a zombie in my door? Oh my gosh, why were you stuck in my door? How did you get in my house? Oh my gosh, get out of here. Oh, so rude. How did you even get inside of here? Is there a spider out there? Noodle, you okay, bud? All right, Noodle is fully holding his own. You can't come in here. He's like one of those baby zombies out there. I'm not opening the door, you can't come in. Yeah, get him, Noodle. Or not, okay. It actually seems pretty happy out there, and it is like a hive of activity. All right, good night, Noodle. Good night, tiny zombie. All right, did everyone sleep well? well there's still lots going on out there. Okay, <laughs> come on, Noodle. Come on, buddy. Oh my gosh! Oh, I'm on fire! No, 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 no! Get to the river! Get to the river! Uh, oh, maybe I'm fine. Already panic over. Noodle is just watching me. Like, hey, what's up? Why were you running? Does good Noodle want rotten flesh? Hmm. I think I've pretty much decided that this is the perfect place for my new house, so not too far away from the old one. I just want to have like a big, nice, flat middle end to work with. Construction of the house is underway, but I don't want to bore you too much with the construction. I will show you the finished product once I am done. I decided to go for kind of like a Swiss farmhouse kind of vibe. I don't know if I have any viewers in Switzerland, but if I do, please comment, because that would be super cool. Okay, got all the materials I need, have a bit more daylight left, except that there are pillagers in my sheep paddock. Okay, close the door. Noodle, did you know about this? If there are ever pillagers in the sheep paddock, you have to let me know immediately. Not that I mad or anything, I just don't want them to hurt the sheep, okay? Oh man, you move so slowly when you've got your sheep. Oh my gosh, you just hit my sheep! You hit my sheep! Okay, everyone knows this, when you mess with my sheep, you mess with me. You come here, in my paddock. <gasps> Did you see Noodle? Noodle just told- Oh my gosh, Noodle's taking them out! Noodle is the best! Look at him go! <gasps> He's protecting his new pals! Oh my gosh, amazing! I am running out of health. Okay, I need to do a flying jump. Flying jump into the paddock. Wait, oh my gosh. I think Noodle just finished them off. <laughs> Oh my gosh, she did! Noodle, you are the best boy! You are gonna get so many pork chops! A small gift from our fallen flock. Alright, well that was a hectic end to the construction day. I didn't actually bother picking up any of the stuff that the pillagers dropped last night because it was getting dark, but I think they dropped something cool. Ominous banner. Alright, what do I do with that? Hey guy, what you doing in the river? Here's the issue, I really like the look of your enchanted bow. Okay, thanks. So here it is, my completed beautiful Swiss farmhouse with a lovely view of the paddock. I also added a small cow paddock at the front here so that the cows can actually come inside the building and the bottom floor of the entire house is just for them. I've also done a lot of organization here on the second floor. I'm getting to that point where I've got loads and loads of different items, so I kind of needed to keep track of them a little bit better. I'm also getting ready to go out on my second adventure because I still don't have any leads and don't have any saddles. Thank you to the person who told me that I could expand my maps by putting some more paper around it. So I'm gonna craft some more paper. Also, I filmed a full house tour of this house, but I lost the footage. So if that's something you wanna see, let me know in the comment section and I'll film it later. Hey, excuse me, you know that the cows live downstairs. Ma'am, I'm gonna ask you to turn around. Um, did that cow just wink at me? It definitely winked. She's like, this is just gonna stay between you and me, right? No one will know I was up here. What are you doing on my chests? I'm sorry, you can't stay up here. I'm preparing for an adventure. Have I got any wheat? No wheat. Okay, that's cool. I've got lots in my food chest. She's gonna be a bit of a nuisance up here. Let's see if I can tempt her downstairs. All right, come with me. This is where you live. <laughs> so this, oh no, they're all coming up the stairs. They're rushing me. All right, so this is the cow section of the house that connects to the paddock. I thought this would be kind of a cool way for the cows to get to also feel like they're, you know, part of the family. Okay, but where's the winker? She's still inside. Oh my gosh, come outside. <laughs> She's like, no, it's warm in here. You built it for me. Don't see what the problem is. Problem is I didn't actually know that you would learn how to climb stairs. So we've reached a compromise. Just these two cows get to stay inside. It's mama and a little cutie. Okay, so getting back to preparing for my next adventure, I was going to add a bit more onto this existing map. Oh, cool. Made it even bigger and bigger. Okay, it looks like there's a creeper hanging out where my old house used to be. Also, not sure if I mentioned this, I've been dyeing my sheep. They are looking just gorgeous. I've been loving the color palette. Hey, where'd that creeper go? Before I head out on my next trip, I did think it would be really, really cool if I could somehow get an infinity bow. So I'm gonna try my luck enchanting this bow, see if I can get unlimited 
arrows or whatever it's called. Also, if this is the first time that you're coming to my mountain lair, welcome. This is where I like to do all of my enchantments. Just up here, please. I've got a bit up here in case I need it. But really, this room is all about enchantments. Enchantments and a beautiful, beautiful view. See how nice that is? And we got unbreaking and power. Not what I wanted. Gonna move on. So it's the morning of the trip. I think I've got everything I need. Are those pillagers? All right, trip or no trip, I will not have you coming into my river, scaring my ladies. It is time to kick you out of this river once and for all, okay? But this has to be quick, because I've got places to go. Okay, bit inconvenient that they decided to just hang out on the other side of the river. Can I, should I row towards them? Maybe I'll just row. Attack! An attack on water. Ooh, there are a lot of them. Okay, I feel a bit useless inside of the boat. Do I get, okay, get out of the boat. Oh no, I didn't bring my noodle. I'm useless without my noodle. I'm starting to feel like I've made a bit of an error. Okay, I'm just gonna take on this guy. Get rid of this guy first. Cool, and then, oh no, there's still three of them left. Do I have time to eat a steak? It would be really great if I could just, oh. Quickly, quickly, quickly. <gasps> no, no, 